What's up, my dad? Now, are you one of the many dads who's waking up in the morning with little to no motivation? Do you feel like motivation is the thing that's holding you back from getting the results that you want? So getting fitter, getting leaner, getting more energized, getting healthier, regaining back your confidence. If you're one of those guys that is saying to himself that I'm not motivated and you're, you're saying motivation is the thing that's holding you back, I want you to consider for a second that it's not motivation that's holding you back. It's your lack of discipline that's holding you back. Because the truth is, you're going to have days where you're motivated and you're going to have days where you're not motivated, right? And so let me break down here. So imagine we're down here and we want to get up over here. And so we're going to be in the red over here. So this is where we don't want to be. This is pain, right? So you're in pain. Maybe your weight is getting out of control. You're gaining a lot of weight. Your, your body fat isn't where you want it to be. Your energy sucks. Your health. So there's all these things going on over here. And again, we're in pain. But yet, we want to get out of this pain. We want to get out of this pain, but we can't get out of it. Because... You can't seem to maintain motivation. So we know we want to get over here. We want to get to the blue, right? We want better fitness. We want better health. We want better body fat percentage. We want more energy, right? Ultimately, we want more confidence in who we are. Like, we want to get over here. However, there's this thing called motivation in the middle that's holding us back. And there's a lot of conversations that I've had with men who are stuck in this pit here that are wanting to get over here, but they just, they can't maintain motivation. They lose the motivation. And so let me, I guess, disagree with me here if this doesn't sound like you, right? Like you start a diet, you start some new training program, whatever the case may be, you get a couple weeks in, things get thrown off, life throws you a curveball. I know how it is. I'm a busy dad. I got three daughters. I run two businesses and life is not easy, right? And so we get thrown off course and things aren't as fresh as they were when we first started. And so we get flipped upside down. We know we still got to do the work, but motivation is gone. Motivation has gone away. And so at that point, that's where you get stuck. You lost motivation. So you go right back to where you were before. You stop. You quit, right? And so that's the unfortunate truth about what's happened with a lot of guys is they, then they, they try it again. Motivation comes back. Oh, it's usually that, that one, the two, the three, the four, maybe even a, you know, a couple month mark you get here, but then you lose that motivation. You lose that momentum and you go right back to where you were. And so I want you to, consider a couple things here, right? Instead of relying on motivation, we're gonna put motivation over here, and just box it up, because motivation is great, right? Again, when you have it, absolutely awesome, right? Like ride that way, but it's gonna run out sooner or later. And so what we need to run off of here is discipline. Discipline, super duper sexy, right? Like whoop de doo Travis, like what a fucking secret, right? Okay, well how do I develop discipline, Travis? How do I create this discipline that's going to get me from this freaking pain pit over here to where it is I want to go, right? Like you're a dad. You want to get back your edge. You want all this over here. How are we going to do it? Well, it's going to require discipline, right? It's going to require you being consistent with the day-to-day -day habits, routines, and behaviors needed to become this over here. So if we think about fitness, health, improving your body fat percentage, increasing your energy, ultimately leading to you having more confidence in yourself, confidence, certainty, clarity in who it is that you are. You have your edge. Your habits, behaviors, and routines need to reflect that. And guess what? Motivation has nothing to do with that shit. Motivation is an emotion, right? Like you're going to feel motivated at times. You're not going to feel motivated at times. And so discipline is something that you develop and it's a trait that you bring on. It's like a code that you live by. All right? And inside this, this Forest Father project, what we do in this thing is we develop a lifestyle built around discipline. And so that's created by a code that we live. And this code, it's easy. Discipline over motivation. Meaning, on the days where you wake up and you know you've got to do X, Y, Z, you've got to go train, maybe you've got to prep your meals, you've got to do something to push yourself forward in this category over here. When that motivation isn't there, you still do the work. You still do the work. And when you do this work and you get consistent at doing that work, that's when these habits, these routines, these behaviors, they start to get instilled into who you are. And in turn, you become this completely different guy. You get yourself out of this pit. You blow through the barrier because you're disciplined versus just running off of motivation. And so 
how else do we develop this discipline? Well, number one, the code's gonna guide you. Another thing that you need to think about before I cut out here is what is your ultimate purpose? What's your mission? What's your vision? Think about what these things are to you. What's your ultimate purpose? Like, why are you wanting these results over here? Better fitness, better health, better physique, more energy, more confidence. Why are you wanting all this ultimately, right? Like, deep down, you want it for yourself. You want to be better. You want to be more. You want to unleash your potential. But you also want to be that leader. You want to be that role model for your family and your kids, right? And so that's your purpose. That's your driving purpose. And so at times where you don't feel like being disciplined, you don't feel like doing the work, you got to come back to your purpose. That purpose is going to relight your fire. It's going to keep your fire fucking lit, right? In addition to that, we have a mission and we have a vision. This is our vision right here. You achieving these goals, you need to see that in your mind. You need to visualize you being fitter. You need to visualize you having better health. You need to visualize how your physique's going to look. Visualize and think about what life is going to be like with more energy. What life is going to be like with more confidence. You visualize that and that keeps you going every single day and you make it your fucking mission to tackle that vision every single day. So every single day you wake up with this mission of getting to this point here, getting out of this pit, right? Like it needs to become your mission to get rid of this pain, leave this place of pain and ascend to this place of better health, better fitness, better physique, all this stuff. It's gotta be your mission. And when you're on that mission, that's going to drive you forward every single day. And then it just becomes about hammering out the different tasks that you need to do on a day-to-day -day basis and just doing it every single day, showing up, doing the work every single day. And so my dad, if you're still here, if you're watching this, this quick training on motivation, right? I'm going to be one of the first guys to tell you that motivation is a bunch of bullshit. And if you're going to continue to rely on motivation, rely on that external motivation, like you need a, a, a quote to get you going or you need, you know, somebody else to you know, get you all riled up so you get motivated again. Like That's great to have that stuff and you definitely need it on your journey, but it is not the one thing that you need to push forward. The one thing that you need is that discipline. And what I just talked about, creating that discipline is gonna be the key to helping you push forward and get back that edge in life, get stronger, get fitter, get leaner, get more energized, get back that freaking confidence that you want and become the ultimate man that you wanna to be to maximize yourself. That's what it's all about. And so put this to use, think of different ways that you can create more discipline in your life. What do you need to be doing on a day-to-day -day basis? What sort of habits, what sort of behaviors, what sort of routines do you need to set up? Think about that. And if you want help with this stuff, this is what we do inside the Force Father. This is what we help you create. It's not about just workouts and nutrition. Like we gotta implement this stuff into your lifestyle to make it work for the long haul. Because you don't wanna be that guy that's getting two weeks down the road, three weeks down the road, a month down the road to only stop and quit and go right back to where they were before. That's what the guys who rely on motivation do. Whereas you develop discipline and you develop key habits, behaviors, and routines, and you stick to those, that's what's going to help you bust through those barriers and get the results that you want. And so if you want help with this, look into applying for the Forge Father Project. We're going to be bringing on a couple more guys. And so if you're ready to put in the work, you're ready to become more disciplined, you're ready to get that freaking edge back, and you're willing to work for it, apply for the Forge Father Project. You do that, we'll get on a call. We'll see if you're a good fit. If you are, we'll take the next steps. We'll get you on the next round, the Forge Father Project.